Okay, so step one is remove your inner hater. If you want to get rid of that annoying voice in your head that says, this verse sucks, I'm no good. In fact, this whole song is terrible. Then this is the step for you. If you want to remove that constant feeling that what you're writing isn't as good as your last shit, then this is the step for you. If you want to stop throwing away all your verses because you feel like you'll never measure up to your favorite rapper, this is the step for you. This step is the solution to your negative thoughts around Rap Writer's Block. In just 10 minutes, I'll show you how to remove that voice that keeps telling you you're whack and you don't measure up, that inner hater. That voice that tells you to throw away the verse only to start over again at the same place with a Rap Writer's Block. After going through step one, these ideas will be able to be used by you to conquer Rap Writer's Block for the rest of your life. You can always come back to the videos, you can always come back to the concepts, and you can use them anytime, anywhere. Bonus footage with the three mindsets that you need in order to conquer Rap Writer's Block. It's a beautiful thing, y'all. You've seen my execution. Eight hours of content on YouTube. The exclusive group. But this is the first time that I've actually structured it out, interviewed other rappers, made a step-by-step -step plan to explain my thoughts, reached back into my past and how I conquered Rap Writer's Block. Now it's here from me to you. Let's end this shit together. Rap Writer's Block is dead.